Alright, so this is a three minute long video. So this is entirely how much information do you want? So I'll show you some of my process. So there's this big binder. Fiance made that cover. I made a template. This isn't the best looking template, but it's a template for me that I went with. Like, if you need to write characters, like, do you, how much information do you want on the character to write the template about them? Like, their clothes, or maybe from here I have a template about their culture, from their cuisine, their jewelry, what they use in battle, maybe some accessories and instruments. Depends if you want to show, like, if they have some kind of culture that's a little unique. Because as long as you have a template, a little more easier to get organized. You keep your project separate from other things, like you don't want to just lump it in with another sketchbook. Because that was a problem with some of my failed projects. I literally just put them in my sketchbooks with other sketches and they would get lost. And then I would not feel motivated and I would just give up. Projects need to be dedicated in their own place at their own time. That's something I struggled with for a long time. But of course that's not enough. I mean, what if that information could get lost in a fire? Now you want something that is capable of not having that problem. So this is my external hard drive. For me, I personally, oh, before we get to that part, also prefer, I always work on everything by paper first. I work better through paper and then putting it on digital because I'm probably old or something. So here are my digital file stuff. We have the accessories. Like for me, it's a little more necessary because there's 500 goddesses, 500 elements. The templates are two pages double-sided so that's technically like four pages each dedicated to each element so that's how complicated it is for me and we have some word documents like they're a little blurb of a biography probably like a little blur like depending on the most important characters story arcs things like that and a little bit more about their world like for example their geography okay i know that map is drawn horribly i was very lazy at that moment i will do it again where it's not looking so lazy Maybe about a little bit about the politics, or if there's holidays, whatever there is. But yeah, it's all in here. This is my personal template. And uh, since my template is definitely not going to be the same as yours, you, uh, you should pick your own template. Here we have some other information. We go into the my outfits thing. It's all this information about the kind of clothes they can wear. I mean, it's basically just sorting the information and stuff. Oh, another thing that's pretty useful. This is something my fiance personally got for me, but Campfire. I know it's not a sponsorship, but uh, it's something I got on Steam. That's supposed to organize some information stuff, where if you don't want to make a template or something, that could work too. I hope that was helpful. Okay, bye.